Hey, my name is Jessica Owen, I specialize in many different areas of the creative industry, and I am Cyclinetics keynote speaker and I controlled musician. Yep. I also have severe cerebral palsy. In most circumstances people tend to notice that I have a severe disability straight up, and that can prevent them seeing the whole picture when they first meet me. I personally find some of the reactions absolutely priceless. My favorite reaction was from a lady who didn't know what to say. She walked up to me and said, Gee, you have nice bones. And that was all she said before walking away. I just proceeded to smile because I was glad she had the confidence to approach me. For me, it is all about spreading awareness. Hopefully I might assist people to understand just because an individual has a severe physical disability, doesn't automatically link them to having an intellectual disability too. I would like to share one of the best moments of my life, because it is a really good example of a perfect reaction to meeting someone with a severe disability and how they should be treated. In February this year, I was lucky enough to meet David Duchovny, on his album tour. His character of Fox Mulder, has always held a special spot in my life ever since I was eight years old. For the reason Mulder is such a strong character, open-minded, believes in almost anything. You can see how I can relate extremely well to that character. So I purchased my VIP ticket, let's go and meet David. I was lining up ready to meet David, the closer I got to the front of the line the wider I became. What if he talks down to me like so many people do? What if he just doesn't understand the CP thing? I have a game plan but what if it fails me? Oh my god I can't do this. I was hyperventilating, because I really cared about how he would react, seeing he was my childhood hero. Believe me I'm never this freaked out normally. At this time there was only one person left in front of me in the line. This stage I couldn't see what was behind the double doors. I had to do something, because I knew if I hyperventilate anymore, I would pass out. I was thinking, pull yourself together, Jessica. It was at this point. My Steve Balby stage persona kicked in. The double doors opened and David experienced one really excited Jessica Owen. It was ridiculous how good David was with me, he didn't speak down to me once. Directed every question to me instead of my carer. Even opened my iPad up because he realized that was my communication device. David basically concluded in his mind, okay a 30 year old, with some sort of severe disability, she has an iPad on her wheelchair, I am guessing that is how she communicates, okay cool. Within the first minute we were having a real conversation, for once I didn't have to prove myself. That was so good. When you think about it, it seems really simple to process, but so many people fail to do this, and allow their assumptions to cloud what is really there in front of them. What it really comes down to, everyone who is physically disabled are all totally individual, however we all have one thing in common, we all want to be treated as intelligent individuals with perfect hearing, ambitions, and purpose.